Oh, that was pretty crazy, eh? Just embracing our fans, you know. I know that how much our team means to our community, and yeah, just seeing the signs and all that there. And, yeah, I was carrying on a bit, but that's just the, the pride and, and the love we have in our jersey and in our, in our fans, so that no, was pretty special. We're here at Panther Stadium. You already know what it is, baby. I grew up in Mount Draught. Uh, I was born in a pan hospital down the road and it's pretty lucky um, considering a lot of boys got to move away from their hometown to chase their NRL dream. I'm a lucky one where I've always stayed in the area. He's regarded as one of the most talented youngsters this club has had in a long time, Jerome Luai. Had a pretty big breakout game for myself and I guess it sort of set me up to where I am today. Luai, here he is, puts it through, oh, what a try! I was just buzzing to get that opportunity, but all my family and that were there, you know, obviously Friday night lights, you get buzzy and yeah, just sort of try to take it with both hands. The second trial was probably the, the one that, that got me the most. Stepped a few players, they were probably tired, so. Blue, oh, look at the footwork, in and out and away. You know, I was, I was a bit skinnier and a bit fitter than just back myself. Blue, oh, gonna score! Oh, a star has been born at the foot of the mountains tonight! I think Sean Johnson was the last guy I had to beat to get over the line, and he's always been one of my idols as well, and that was a pretty special trial for me. Yeah, so 2018, 2019, like was in and out of the side. 2020 was like a big year for me because that's when I got my first starting role uh, within the side. Made the grand final, didn't win that one, which was definitely heartbreak, um, but we definitely used that motivation to then the next year, our grand final year. That is the ball game. Look at the face on Adam Reynolds. I think it was a bit different from the, the previous grand final and we just, you know, took our, our chances when they came. And, the Panthers celebrate. We just grabbed each other and I was just screaming. I don't know what I was screaming. I was just yelling at the top of my lungs. Um, it was a dream come true for us all, uh, especially the previous year that we had, losing one to then winning one. But yeah, I know I had an eighth there and we are just hugging each other. Yeah, like best friends, I guess. The Premiers of 21, the Penrith Panthers. I remember grabbing my phone and FaceTiming my parents on the field straight away. They were back in Mountie and the, the house was popping off, so yeah, I remember just showing in my ring on FaceTime and my little son was there on my shoulders as well, so I know they were proud and they were having some good times over there, so I'm just happy we got the job done. Just Mount Druid itself, just knowing that we've got their full support and that we're some sort of inspiration to not only the young, young kids but the olders as well, you know, to do something special for them and their family, so it was definitely special to see. We just want to be, I guess, real like role models for kids because there's so many talented people out there you know if they're able to put their focus and interest into something positive they can do anything in life so yeah that's the message we're trying to portray